President. ETS, of course, as a policy instrument isn't perfect, but it is the key policy instrument that we have here in the EU. And it's interesting that those today who have criticised it have done just that. That's all they've done. They've just criticised it. They've come up with no concrete idea of how else we would reduce greenhouse gases. And on that basis, one can only conclude that they have no concern about decreasing greenhouse gases. In fact, in many cases, I'm well aware of the fact that they deny that there's any problem at all with greenhouse gases. And this is, it's unfortunate that that sort of argument is still going on here because it certainly is way out of, of the mainstream of thinking on the science on these issues. I would like to just mention one issue, and that's carbon leakage. We need to take into account the competitiveness of industry. This is not incompatible with our climate change objectives. And it's very annoying to hear yet again today a polarisation of these arguments. We talk about converting to low carbon technologies. Only yesterday Mr Timmermans sat here and told us that the future of European industry is in smart green technology. But in order to advance that we need to have investment, we need to be profitable and we need to be able to have the funds to go forward and make that change. Thank you.